Thanks for joining the 2017 BYU Football Media Day web chats. I'm Lauren Frank, and we're here with Elisa Tuiaki and Ed Lamb. How are you guys doing? Doing well, thanks. I feel like there's a few things we need to get out of the way that I've found out about recently. Ed, you play the bass guitar in a band. It's you been hear months. Him sing. True or false? I have. Uh, uh, that's false. I, it's been months. <laughs> the band broke up when I left Cedar City. Ah, oh, dang uh, it! It's been months since I picked up picked up the bass. Really? Yeah. But have you played like your whole life? Have you usually been in a band? Uh, I picked up uh, guitar and bass, started playing like um, in college. Yeah. That is awesome. We, we had our senior party and the uh, band brought him up and he sang. Yeah. That was a big crowd. Everyone you sang was too? Oh yeah. yeah. Hey. Good. So you're the bass guitarist and lead singer? Would you no, do both? So no, we, we all sang. We, we uh, fashioned ourselves after like the Eagles or the Beach Boys, like everybody in the band sang. Uh, <laughs> yes. so, when I would sing lead, which wasn't very often, uh -huh. then I would usually play the rhythm guitar because I'm not talented enough to play the bass That'd and be sing hard. lead. That's tough. That yeah, would be really tough. People do it, but not me. That is awesome, though. I love. I'm in a band, so I love that. When uh, I what's out. your instrument? I sing. That's it. My voice. My voice. That's that's it. That's uh, it. Yeah. You got to pick up an instrument now. I know. I need to. I'm learning the guitar. Yeah. I'm decent. Oh, are you? You know the basic, basic chords. So. Well, it's time for the band to let you do your thing. That's right, yeah. Sometimes the guitar's every song I write it has a D and a C and a G, you know, all the basic chords. Yeah. It's fun, though. So now that we know Ed's hidden talent, what, what hidden talent do you have, Elisa? I don't have any. You get Ed, what you see. <laughs> what hidden talent would you say, or what's something about him that not very many people would know? Um, so he has um, the fastest swing speed in golf, like in, including professional hey. golf. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know about that. And, uh, and uh, we were at a, a fundraiser golf tournament last week, and there were two um, young girls at one of these hole sponsors, <laughs> like maybe high school, college age. And he walked away to start um, swinging, and I was still there trying to grab some free tees, you know, as, get as many as I can when yeah. they're free. And they started talking about his calves. They don't have enough. His calves. They started, really? Yeah, they're like, his calves are amazing. So I think it's appropriate to pull up his <laughs> pants and show Did you start? Did you Show start walking up. on your tippy toes once you heard him say that? Just give him a little, <laughs> a little more oomph. I think they were That's talking about my pose at the end. I mean, I was trying to flex <laughs> as hard as I could. That's a talent right there. Is there anyone else on the coaching staff that has a cool hidden talent? We know like tie fishes and hunts, you know. Kalani, I'm not, I'm not sure. What's Kalani's hidden talent? He, he's got a lot, but Jack DeMooney <laughs> can sleep on just like that. That's really? Right. Yeah. Fall Does he have narcolepsy or he just No, 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 it's tired. a talent now. Yeah. It's a talent. <laughs> that is awesome. Well, you guys have a stout defense this year. What are you guys most excited for? We're going to start with Elisa about your defense. Just watch, watch the kids play, you know. I, I think it's, uh, I, we're, we're, uh, we do the coaching and all that stuff, and after it's all done, uh, being able to stand on the sideline, and along with Cougar Nation, watch the kids play and make plays. Yeah. That's, that's going to be exciting. That's awesome. What about you, Ed? Yeah, I agree. Yeah, it's our it's our job to get out of their way. We have a lot of ability in there. We got to keep them humble, you know. I mean, be careful with comments like we have a stout defense. Right. We haven't forced a single punt yet, right. and so it's our job to kind of balance between telling them how how good they can be, but also keeping them humble, letting them know it's about a daily process. We got to keep getting better. I've noticed that's the theme because the other coaches that we've interviewed so far, if I've made some sort of statement like that, they're like, oh, ho, ho. Yeah, you know, like, oh, the, yeah. the offensive line's gonna be in there. Like, we haven't done anything yeah. yet. So that's, that must be something you're preaching to the guys currently, is it? Just like, stay humble, stay humble wait till you get on the hard. field, and then yeah. see how good you are. Yeah, you, you, I mean, if you have any background in athletics at all, you know how quickly you can get right. ahead of yourselves. As soon as we start thinking we're pretty good at something, then, you know, the, the football gods cut our legs out from under us and we have to start over and be it's humbled true. again so that's that's part of our job the experience of being a little older and being through that keep the guys humble keep them working hard and when the media gets involved too yeah. you know they kind of yeah. like to blow up some of the players heads and stuff <laughs> i i understand yep. i understand we all have our jobs we all yeah have we all do our thing yeah. <laughs> so speaking of your defense they like to do impersonations of you guys i don't know if you guys watch between the lines last week, but it was the offensive line versus the defensive line. And they did impersonations of coaches and players. And then back during the football season, one of your players did an impersonation of you, sort of. Of me? Yeah, so we're going to pull I them up. I didn't know I was impersonable. We're, 
Well, so, that's why I said sort of. So we're going to pull up Ed's first. And then get it pulled up. It's from... Can anyone do an impersonation of Ed Lamb? She's been trying to think about one for a while. Yeah, it's not possible. He just uses big words all the time. <laughs> <laughs> I have to look him up after meetings. <laughs> So that was it. That was their impersonation yeah, of you. They said that's you, good. you use big words all the time. Is that true? Um, you're a I, smart guy, because even when we interview you, yeah. you're very smart, and it's awesome. I don't know. I don't. Uh, I certainly don't think of myself as smart. So I, I'm, I'm, I'm pleased. I'm pleased that they think I'm smart. You're pleased with that. Yeah. And you should be pleased. They couldn't actually do an impersonation of you. Yeah. Because it was pretty easy for them to do the other coaches. Yeah, well, I'm always trying to They're get like, my personality a little better. I'm changing, you know. That's a good job changing things up. Switch it up before they can catch on anything. Down. That's awesome. Okay, we're going to pull up the one that I think it was. Who did it of you? Tavita. It was Tavita Maunga. That was a bad and one. you we did saw see it. It was a bad one, yeah. You saw it. Okay, we're going to pull it up. We're going to see for ourselves. <laughs> I got to see it. I haven't right. seen it. Yeah. Here you go. Karua. <laughs> Where you at? Wake up. Your mom. <laughs> so do it looks good that? just because How he just it? looks like an idiot. So. <laughs> look like an idiot. You look like Coach Tuyaki. <laughs> do you say your mom? Your mom is that some? Is that one of your go-to? I mean, my siblings and I. We. I mean, we're all, uh, I guess, uh, movie movie people, and so. A lot, of, a lot of quotes and a lot of stuff like that. So the mom one probably came from a Napoleon Dynamite. Your mom. Goes to college or something. I, don't Your mom I can't remember. Goes to college. Yeah. That's awesome. Well, you tweeted out. So I know you saw it. Oh, you I saw it. You tweeted yeah. out that you could do an impersonation of Tavita. <laughs> so we're gonna, we're gonna hold you to that. I, I didn't say that. I said, I said, oh, oh you're... I got it. I got it here. You ready? Okay. Here we go. You That's said, you oh, tweet, snaps, man. we're impersonating now, huh? I got one for you. Oh, uh, yeah. so I was going to make him run, like, during fall camp or something. <laughs> so it wasn't an impersonation. All right. You don't have one? I'll do one. OK, let's do it. Let's see your best. Tevita. This is Tevita, right? Yeah. <laughs> you get a good one. All right, you ready? Yeah. Okay, it's, uh, hey, my name's Tevita. I'm 350, but I speak like this. <laughs> Oh my gosh, clip that off and send that to him immediately. Oh, that was fantastic. We're going to move on okay. and we're going to play. Oh, we, what do we need? This is what we need, these cards. Have you guys ever played the headphone game before? No. So what's going to happen? We're going to start with you, Eliza. You put these headphones on and I'm going to give Ed two of these cards and you don't show them to him and don't show these to him either. So I'm going to push play on this so you can't hear. And so he's going to say it to you. You have to guess what he's saying, OK? Oh. They're all football terms. They're all football terms? Yes, they are. Oh. So this isn't my phone. I don't know her password. We're going to have a special guest come and help us with the music here. OK. Can you hear that? Is it loud enough? Yeah, that's good. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? OK. Here you go. Go ahead. So you're going to be looking at Ed. Lavelle Edwards. Lavelle <laughs> <Well>, Edwards. <laughs> you can't yell it at him. Oh, you didn't? Oh, OK. <laughs> what, are, what are the rules? <laughs> you got to do it on beat, man. I'm oh, sorry. That's my fault. No, you say it, and then he tries to guess what you're saying, because he can't hear you. So he's trying to guess what you're saying. Does that make sense? OK. So if I had something that said block and punt, I'd say block and punt, and he's trying to read your lips. Oh, OK. It's lip reading, All in right. essence. Well, we're getting next one. Pick six. <laughs> Dude, that looked like you swore at me. You said the B word at me, like a female dog. So he just called me. <laughs> he did it. Keep going. So you keep going until he gets it. That's you it. Just say oh. it. You should keep saying Pick it. Six. Business? Pitch it? Pick six. Pitch it? <laughs> <laughs> he, he, said, he, he said female dog, right? He's like, not. He's not. Nope. <laughs> nope. Say it slower. Pick six. <laughs> <laughs> I, I want to say it, he but I not, He has nothing else in his head except for a swear word. That's all I, I just keep yeah, doing the just same thing. He... I get no creativity either. So <laughs> nope. I just have to keep doing this. Straightforward, yeah. <laughs> He's swearing. He's not. Why would you make him swear? That's messed up. <laughs> I just, can I okay, just one more concede? Time. Okay. One more time. Pick six. Oh, pick six. Hey, 
there. You got silent, it. Silent. <laughs> oh, so you actually heard it. Oh, man. Okay, now switch. You're going to do that to him. Okay. Oh, now give him the headphones. He's you got to be a little more animated you when you the... enunciate, man. <laughs> oh, my gosh. This is great. Okay. Make sure you can't hear. Oh, okay. Can you hear? Oh, uh, is it under this? All right, there? Yeah, those are the words. Yeah, you can take that off. Okay. Flip, oh, flip the headphone around. That side. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> That's why you He's can't dying. impersonate it. He knew what to do. He's just mixing it up. He's just changing his personality. He's just trying to change on it so that we never impersonate him. <laughs> Did you break those? <laughs> I don't know that if he's ever I not there, dude. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. All right, here we go. Can you Song hear? Song on? Okay. okay. Ready? Okay. Tackle. Tackle. Oh, ooh. I'm just Got it. Enunciate. Face mask. Face mask. <laughs> you really couldn't hear? That's it? He can't hear. <laughs> you got it. Good. That was it, right? That was impressive. Yeah. I'm very impressed with that. I just. It's the way that you do your lips, <laughs> you just like the Ninja Turtles back, the original Ninja Turtles, you know, uh -huh. the way you do your lips. Yeah. Enunciation. <laughs> Good job. Well, I think there's no better way than to end right there, because that was a phenomenal, yeah. phenomenal interview. Thanks so much, guys, All for right, being here. Thanks. Coming up next, we have Diane Gonwoloku and Micah Hanneman.